Rohit Kambi, the people of Afghanistan have actually been very close to India. Uh, I mean, some surveys have said that 70% uh, of the population, you know, feel closer to India than any other country. So that's something that uh, really shows that people-to-people -people relationship is ultimately, which is where public diplomacy is driving, being driven in the future. This this relationship is is uh, can be can be the foundation of this relationship. No, one of the funniest things, go traveling through Afghanistan, you know, what you see everywhere in Afghanistan, people watch Indian movies and people listen to Indian music. And that's one of the things which has brought Afghanistan closer to India in many, many ways. Uh, way back in 96, 97, still not so much, but 2009, 10, as I travel, people knew how to speak Hindi much better. I was shocked at places okay. I'd been to before. And so I think that is certainly one of our ties with Afghanistan. Beyond that, they look at India with a lot more trust and faith. Sure. The Afghan army, I went into right. their ISAF training camp. Uh, uh, one of the soldiers said, the amount of the quality of training we get from India is far different from the ones we get from the United States. And this is better because it's about minimalistic use of fire than what we get from the Americans. So I think their faith lies because they have a lot of cultural uh, similarities in many, many ways with us. And do you think that this could be harnessed in a sense uh, to create markets for their products in India? Uh, because, I mean, a lot of their agricultural produce, for instance, would uh, have dry fruits for one, could be, uh, could have huge markets in India. And so what I think the, we've been negotiating, India has been negotiating with Iran as well as with uh, Afghanistan, is the trilateral treaty on uh, right. and transportation of these goods via the, uh, the, the port. And I think that is where the key to India-Afghanistan relationship lies. Okay. Uh, beyond, obviously, uh, if Pakistan doesn't let uh, the supplies from both sides cross sure. easily, then I think that's where the future lies to start with. And then beyond that, in expanding that to gas and oil and things like that, which again will happen from Central Asia, where India has right. great interest. Uh, General Sony, so given